He's selling Ika, which is squid on a, on a stick. This is Chris from Beers in Japan. We're entering what's called Nishiki. It's one of the most famous streets in all of Japan. I mean, not just in Kyoto, all of Japan. They have all sorts of traditional Japanese things here. These are Japanese sweets. These look like um, kuyan. Okay, they're like onko, which is like a paste uh, thing, bean paste inside, and there's stuff on top of it. Pretty tasty. The first time I saw onko, I thought it was raisins. Actually, kind of embarrassing. Here, this is dongos. Dongos is I don't like dongos. It's got this. It's very very too sweet for me. It's got, it's got this taste of like mushy in your mouth here. Okay, and then I'm just gonna scroll through. Later on in the future videos, I'll do these are raw oysters I had night, the night for dinner. Really really popular in Japan. In, in in the future, I'm going to do a video for you guys on individual shops and foods, but. Here we got, um, what do you call these, um, skemono. Skemono is, you know, by people that are rice, it's like these pickles, different types of pickles. Very, very popular in Japan. Okay, there's a traditional <laughs> drugstore, obviously, in the middle of a traditional street. Not the great place for a drugstore, but it is what it is. More traditional sweets. Here, just going to give you guys a feel. And right now... Because in the middle of the COVID-19 situation, uh, it's not a lot of people here. Here's some selling some fish. You can see there's all sorts of cool stuff. Just going to scroll through here today and give you guys a feel. And I'm going to come back here another day and talk about individual shops. Wow, look at that. It's a very nice shop selling all sorts of traditional like, uh, tea, tea stuff. All right, this is all pottery and tea stuff. It's really, really cool. Actually, I'm not a huge into pottery myself, but when I see something like that, I think, wow, that's cool. All right, here's tofu. It's on tofu. Ice cream, of course, which is not necessarily a traditional Japanese thing, but ice cream is immensely popular, especially soft serve ice cream. And there. Here we go. He's selling Ika which is squid on a, on a stick. Very, very popular and common in Japan. It's another place selling fish. All right, guys, you gotta get a feel. If you ever wanna get out to Japan, this is at Kyoto. You definitely wanna hit Nishi. It's a fun, fun city. It stretches all the way over there. So I'm gonna stop the video here, and this is Chris from Beers in Japan, and I hope you get to Kyoto and check out Nishiki. And please subscribe to our channel.